What is up, Turtle here, coming at you with a Pokemon Masters video. It's been quite a while since we've done one of these, and if you have not been paying attention, the game is actually really good right now. I feel like they really turned the corner and they made a lot of improvements. Um, recently, there's been a lot of really cool events where you get legendary Pokemon like Mewtwo, Sogaleo, all for free. You just have to do like the events and stuff, and it doesn't take, the first one was kind of grindy, but now they've improved. Uh, they dropped Rayquaza as well, and today we're gonna be doing a lot of pulls we have accumulated 47,000 gems oh and the game is still super free to play still haven't paid have bought any paid gems we have 47,000 we're going to probably drop looking to drop 30,000 gems and uh, so the newest events you know they got this new battle villa thing which I haven't checked out yet but the new <clears throat> shining star events they do have a concept where if you do pull for some of the new stuff you get additional kind of like a multiplier and you can only do that I think the missions a certain number of times uh, so potentially we do want the Cygna suit Alessa in Rotom however she's actually third on our list of Pokemon or sync pairs to grab the first one should be kind of obvious we definitely want red and Charizard but I think I'm good with just getting one of them I don't I have no strong desire to finish like the sync move and stuff and level that up because after if we manage to pull him and it's 10 two percent chance 10 percent for five star then we're actually going to go for steven and metagross i do really like metagross i would like to pick him up and he is they call it this fair scout so it's kind of limited and then then and only then will we try to pull for cygna suit alessa and again we'll probably we'll go for thirty thousand gems or 10 pulls all together 10 10 pulls 100 sync pairs all together and, and then towards the end we'll kind of talk about my progress through the game it's a lot of fun i would say the only thing that the game is kind of lacking is really challenging content even content that i don't if i can't beat it that's fine but i think it's a good thing for the game to have where you actually have to have the right sync pairs the strongest ones fully maxed out to complete and just for those people that really spend a lot of time to max out all their characters like right now i auto everything and basically i can complete all the contents and again if if i can't that's I'm perfectly fine with that I'll just wait till the power creep gets to the point where I can do that but all right without further ado let's get into our first pull let's see if we can't pull this red and Charizard he looks pretty cool Charizard looks amazing the sync attack looks great actually that'll take too long all right let's do our first one we have 47,000 we're gonna do 10 pulls I it would be amazing if we can get all three I kind of doubt it but here we go first pull 2% chance at finding red 10% chance for a rainbow so you should get a rainbow each one would be nice to get more than one and we definitely did get at least one rainbow here we go <clears throat> who are you pincer okay looks like this first time I got hurt Pelipper Crusher Roxy and Whirlipede sure sure where's our five-star Voltorb we don't really care about you guys. Noland again. And alright, what is this? Oh my gosh, did we get it right away? <laughs> One pull, and we got Red and Charizard. How about that? Okay, maybe we will get Alessa as well. And oh, we're still not done. What are the chances? Wow, that was amazing. If, um,. You know, if that was our goal, we'd be like, hey, look, we saved so many gems. But, you know, I feel like I like how we approach this where Steven came out and we did wait because we were, I was pretty sure Red would kind of there's like leaks and stuff like that. And the Metagross banner is sticking around till into March, mid-March. So it gave us time to wait and to, we want to pick it up. And now is the perfect time. We still have plenty of pulls left. Let's get Steven. And then if we can also get Alessa so we can really maximize this new event. Wow, I can't believe we got red in one pull. If you're still playing the game, let me know how you feel about all these recent changes. I think they have been great. And let me know how your pulls have been. Did you manage to get red? Man, were you able to get as fortunate as we were to get it in a single try? All right, I don't even think we got a rainbow here, which is pretty disappointing, especially consider these are fair rates and it's 10% chance. So I'm... Um, Pretty sure there's no like fake out mechanic where if you didn't if it didn't show the rainbow that you could still get it all right so nothing there 
But actually, we shouldn't complain. We already got the main one we want. There's still a good amount of five stars that we don't have. But to be honest, you know, until an event comes up where I actually need something, like, actually, I've been able to accomplish all the content so far, so I don't really mind that. But, you know, we're still missing, I think we don't have Totodile. That's probably the one that I, the striker that we're kind of missing. Like, we don't have a good water team. All right, here we go. We did get a five star. Let's, let's make it the Metagross, then we can go for that Alessa. Although, that is back to that 7% chance. So here, I guess technically, it would be pretty good to pick up some of those 5 stars that we're still lacking. One unfortunate thing is for these Poke Fairs, there's no crossover. So you can't pick, you can't pull Metagross from the red one and vice versa. Alright, where is that 5 star? Okay, what is this? Is it? I'm... Oh, okay, we got total dial. Again, that, that, what I was just saying is now we have that water striker. So I'm actually pretty happy with that. Again, if we can nab a bunch of five stars while we're still doing these pulls, instead of, as opposed to moving to that 7% rate. I would like to get it, you know, if we can't maximize the current event, I'm not even sure if you need to, um, but we do, I'd, I'd, prioritize getting the limited time banner limited time sync pair over kind of maximizing the event <clears throat> all right uh, I think we can just skip this I'm pretty sure that means we won't get anything else okay so two pulls complete whiffs all right I think that means we're due for a double five star pull All right, so this will be our fifth pull. Ooh, we can skip the whole entire thing altogether. Wow, that was terrible. All three stars. Okay, things are getting rough. Steven, I'm <laughs> hope you're worth it. This is getting expensive. All right, come on, show me some rainbows. Oh, did we miss again? Wow, what is this? Maybe we should go back to Red and just maximize his sync move. But Red, ooh, okay, we do get it. We got a rainbow. Red does sound really strong. Ooh, what is this? Is this Alessa? Okay, we already have her. Okay, so we did level up the sync move. Come on, we can still get another one. Man, come on. Hmm. Actually, it is only two percent chance to pull the uh, featured, so we I, maybe that just means we got super lucky uh, pulling red really easily. <clears throat> and it did give us a chance to get everything that we wanted, but we might come up short. I think we have two more pulls. Come on, get that rainbow. Let's get a double. I feel like having two big whiffs at ten percent banner is. Kind of setting we could kind of balance it a little bit with a double right here okay b drill <clears throat> most of these i've never even used maybe they're good all right what is this i can't start all by yourself come on oh no this is a dupe as well come on another one Ah oh, man, this is a little disappointing. All right, so the chances of getting Alessa are all but out the window. Two pulls remaining. We did get a five star though, but we still need that double. Let's do this, come on. Uh oh, it doesn't look good. <laughs> Actually, I think it's when the door starts opening. That's the real indicator. Okay, all right, we at least got one. Still have a chance for a double. And now we're starting to over get these power-up tickets, which we don't really use. Although, actually, Mew is a three-star, another one that um, I think the event's still going on. So if you're watching this, like, oh, maybe I should get back in the game, definitely do it. Ooh, you want to go explore him? The guy who's... Who are you? Oh, Cyndaquil, interesting. Okay, that that's one we don't have. Ethan, nice. We'll take it. Oh, yes, we did get a double. And is this Metagross? Yeah. 
<laughs> oh my gosh, these pulls are going amazing. We did get the medic and we got the double. Yeah, the triple is way too greedy. We're, 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 we're good. <laughs> So what is Cynico? Oh, a Fire Firestrike. That's good because we did get Hilda Tepig and that recoil is just too much. The the amount of extra HP that the opponents have, that 20% is like you take more percent damage than your opponent. All right, we got Steven, we got Red, we got one more pull. So we have one shot at getting Alessa and then we can really maximize this event. Yeah, and I do think it's worth it not going for, actually, let's just check this. Oh uh, yeah, I'm close. And yeah, we, chances, I think it's still 2% chance at pulling her, but the overall five star rate is a little bit lower. But I think we got actually, I think we don't, so the ones we don't have are Kukui, Eevee, and Pidgeot. That actually might be it. I think we have all the other ones. I'm not sure if we have Galalee. But my point is, you know, that lack of 3%, uh, maybe it's gonna be okay. So let's just go for it all. I will be so happy we can accomplish everything that we set out to do. Come on, mm, maybe we should, should we keep going? I feel like this idea of you have to pull is just like the way to kind of like, you know, I, I, I don't mind the mechanic, but it just kind of encourages you to keep pulling, um, but most likely you don't need to, but I'm not sure kind of like how you can do one of the events per day. Oh my gosh, did we get it? Who is this? This is the dust clops, I think. Uh, it's all right. Okay. <clears throat> Level two. Come on, we can pull a double. Show me some words. Yeah, so I'm not sure if, I don't know, maybe you can get to really finish the event. Oh wait, I think we do have one more pull. I, mis I miscalculated. So we started at 47. I said we we're going to spend 30,000. So we should end at 17. So we do have one more try. And so far, so we did get one double and one or two without any five stars. So if we can, this could be a double, then we'll basically get uh, 10 five stars across 10 pulls, which would be great considering that some one of two of them are at 7%. And we did get, we definitely have a rainbow. I'm not sure what the difference between if you see the rainbows here versus just when the door is opening. I don't do enough pulls to figure that out. But all right, here goes. Then I can start that event finally. Ah, is this another Dustclops? Dustclops is used a lot, but I don't feel the need to finish sync moves. And we're way too far away from getting the five star potential increases. Come on, give me one more. Give me that Elissa. Ah, it doesn't look good. But hey, you know what? Out of 10 pulls to get nine five stars, we will take it. Dustclops and Phoebe. All right, so that's gonna, that was our last poll. But uh, yeah, again, the game is really good right now. I am so happy we only use, need to use 3,000 gems to pull red. Steven was pretty rough. That was rough. And we did fail to pull um, Alessa. I wonder how necessary it is. Uh, actually, we can just take a look. Because, you know, um, we saved up for a long time. I am not really sure how this works. So you have to do the missions to get these travel tokens. And obviously, so you can pick up different things. Like, I figure, let's just try to complete this. I have no idea how many maps there are and all that stuff. And having Alessa, so we, we can do the, these two. So we do have 0.7 times extra, but it can go up to 1.7. All right, let's do one more. We'll do one more time. 33,000 gems spent. The Poke Fairs, I am 100% behind. This one is a little iffy, but I feel like I'm feeling confident. I'm not sure where the confidence is coming from. All right, 11 pulls. This will be our 11th pull. So far, we've gotten nine five stars. All right, show some rainbows. 
Oh boy. So we could have already seen it already. However, that doesn't necessarily... It seems like that doesn't indicate that you get multiple by any means. Oh, but the fact that we don't see it here, that's a bad... That's... That's bad news. Alright, do we keep going? I'm thinking no. You know, we'll, we'll have to do some research and see how necessary it is to have her and kind of like what you additionally gain from that and if there's something significantly good um, you know maybe maybe we'll have a follow-up and where we do try to get get her where we'll spend a little bit more gems <clears throat> but uh, yeah so if you're just curious or how we're kind of developing actually I've been starting to upgrade gear basically all the events except except for these ones that just dropped uh, we're basically done. Actually, so it's weird. They kind of brought this Mewtwo thing back, but you can't actually farm the event. So I'm not really sure how you're supposed to do that. Uh, Professor Oak, we wrapped up all these. This, we just have some stuff that I don't really care to purchase. And same thing here. We actually maxed out of those. That's why I don't buy those. And so all the events were basically done. And then as far as our gear goes... All right, so we'll just go to the bottom. So we are filtering just for two stars. So our rock is done, not entirely done. Looks like we got two things wrapped up. So we just have to improve this guy. Three more levels. I think Psychic is complete. Dragon is entirely complete. Grass, looks like we're just missing one more. I just finished the electric one. And fire, we still have, oh no two of three as well so we're going pretty fast uh, we don't have any of the water but that's basically because I didn't have the total dial so now we can easily do that and I think there's still a couple more like bug and ghost but we'll, we'll get to those eventually but at this point you can do those I, I bet like three stars are coming actually they got these new lucky moves that we'll need to get to start uh, trying to farm I'm not really sure how that works just yet and let's just see uh, as far as Syncrid I haven't even done Syncrid stuff yet that's why I mean how easy the game is uh, but again I'm, I'm assuming they're gonna start putting some r difficult stuff that uh, so actually, I guess we were farming Firewub quite a bit and Flint got a bunch of sync attacks off. And then we have almost 9,000 uh, generic sync orbs. So that's kind of where we're at right now. But uh, yeah, really happy with the results of the polls. Kind of disappointing. Or we spent a lot to get that Steven, but we did get some good stuff. And then the Alessa was, for the most part, just a miss. Uh, so not too happy about that. In fact, we got two two more dust clops which it's it's a good cut it's a good sync pair but that's gonna be it for me today guys as always thanks for watching i'm wanted turtle i'll catch you guys next time